Welcome to JRL Studio Creations. Today I'd like to show you how to preserve beautiful fall leaves. It's so amazing. It captures its natural color and feels like leather. Let's get started. The first thing you want to do is to go out in nature. Ah, oh, it's so nice. Find yourself a beautiful leaf and pick it off the tree. Just watch out for bugs. I found some really beautiful leaves. This one had an L on it and this one was a different type, <laughs> as well as this one, it was just super red. Hi! Okay, today we're gonna be doing something so awesome. I have a tub here, it's just a plain old tub. <laughs> and we're gonna take some glycerin, and we're going to mix equal parts, glycerin and water, to be able to preserve these beautiful leaves. <laughs> Let's get started. Okay, so, one part water and one, wait, one cup water, one cup glycerin. This is the glycerin part. This is water. So equal parts water and glycerin, and we're gonna stir it up. So, exfoliate. <laughs> okay, so now with these leaves, uh, we're going to want this to actually suck up the juices, so we're going to take off the tail end of this. Thank you. So this will be able to help suck it up the juices. Yeah, tumbleweed. I love that one. That's my favorite. The most important thing to remember is to fully submerge the leaf in the glycerin and water and make sure it has a fresh cut stem. All right, once you're done actually putting all the leaves in there, make sure they're totally submerged and we're going to want to take some saran wrap and put it over the top. Saran wrap and put it over the top. We're actually going to set it right on the water we're going to leave this in here for a couple of days and the capillary action will be able to suck in through the actual leaf and get the glycerin up into the leaf. That's why we had to trim off the ends. Also make sure there's no air bubbles between the saran wrap and the leaves and glycerin and water. Alrighty, it's been a few days and look at this. Woo, it's all wet and goopery. So through capillary action, it's actually sucked in the glycerin and the water through the leaf and now it's preserved the leaf. So we're going to pat these dry and let them fully dry off and they'll be ready to go. That's so cool. Another thing that's so cool about this is this is also how they make forever roses. They suck in glycerin and it makes it so it preserves the rose for like super, super long time. Like sometimes even decades, <laughs> which is so, so cool. But yeah, this is pretty much the process of how they do that. Looking good. Oh, let's miss that one. These are absolutely stunning. It's preserved the color and like it's not crunchy at all. It's just beautiful. I really love how simple this process is and it's amazing how well preserved the leaves turn out. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and please share it with your friends. If you have any comments, please put them in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe. You're amazing. Have a great day. Bye.